Yesterday, we watched the inauguration of our new president, and I was struck by two very different themes. First was the ceremony and the traditions behind the event. Watching former presidents and first ladies come to welcome in the president-elect. The star-spangled banner and the Pledge of Allegiance. And of course, the oath of office itself. And with those words, the transfer of power of the highest elected official in our country. And these traditions have been passed on for generations and centuries as old as our democracy itself. But I was equally struck by the complete opposite, which was the uniqueness of yesterday's inauguration and moments that we had never seen in the past. Watching this Pledge of Allegiance be signed simultaneously as it's recited. J-Lo finishing her song by speaking in Spanish of liberty and justice for all. And for me, the most profound movement, the most profound moment, which was watching Supreme Court Justice Sotomayor swear in Vice President Kamala Harris, seeing on that stage two women of color representing some of the highest positions in our executive and judicial branches. And I thought of the intentionality put into this event to include and acknowledge communities who had been left out in the past of our history. And I'm also hopeful by the executive orders that our new president has announced or even signed already to end the Muslim ban, to stop the wall, and to create a pathway towards citizenship for our immigrants. At Asian Americans Advancing Justice LA, we will never stop fighting for the rights of our Asian American, Native Hawaiian, and Pacific Islander communities under any administration, including this one. We want to see more. We want to see an end towards deportations and long detentions and inhumane treatment of our immigrants. But I gotta say, yesterday's event was definitely a step in the right direction.